السلام علیکم دس از احمد قیوم اف یو آر فائنڈنگ اٹ ڈیفیکلٹ ٹو رائٹ قرآن اینڈ ٹرانسلیشن ان اڈابی پروڈکٹس اور اینی ادر ڈیزائن ٹول دین لیٹ می گائڈ یو دیٹ ہاؤ یو کین رائٹ عربک اردو ٹرانسلیشن انگلش ٹرانسلیشن اور اینی ادر لینگویج ٹرانسلیشن ان اینی ادر لینگویج سو دیر آر ویری فیو سمپل اسٹیپس دیٹ یو کین فالو اینڈ یو کین رائٹ قرآن ٹیکسٹ اینڈ ٹرانسلیشنز So I have made a few experiments in Adobe InDesign. There you can see that in front of me it's Adobe InDesign. And I have also made experiments in Adobe Photoshop. I have also made experiments in Adobe Illustrator and in Adobe XD as well. But the the method was not working in this specific tool because uh, this is for the ui design and other animations so the the same method is working perfectly in photoshop and adobe indesign but there are some issues in illustrator as well so let me guide you that how you can write such type of text in photoshop and indesign so this is one of my favorite website that i have found and its name is quran clip helper.com so you just have to go to this link i will also mention the link inside the description uh so it's very easy to find your text quran text or the translation you want to copy so you just have to choose the chapter number so for example let's go to chapter number 18 and let's go to aya number 4 okay so there you can see that the arabic text in front of you and you can choose the translation up here so i have selected translation in urdu so you can choose any translation that you want to read or you want to copy So for example you are from Germany and you want translation in German so so yeah you just have to click here select the translation you want to see and just hit enter so let's go to so let's go back to urdu so uh yeah there are some issues so let's change the the author let's go to dr israr and yeah so now let's copy the the text so i have already recorded three to four videos that how you can write quran text but this is one of the most effective video and there are some settings that you have to make before copying the text So in Adobe InDesign you have to create a frame tool you have to create a rectangular frame then go to text just click inside this rectangular frame and then go to paragraph and select Adobe World Ready Single Line Composer go to character and let's choose font that is noor e hira and set the size as 36 now go back to quran clip helper.com copy the text go back to indesign and hit control v from your keyboard just go to paragraph and make it right align Okay select all go to character and increase the text size So yeah it's very simple to copy text and it's almost perfect almost perfect Let me show you that if you find some issues for example yeah so let's copy this text 
go back to Adobe InDesign, select all, paste, select all, reduce the text and let me guide you. So if you go back and if we are going to verify the Quran text, so there you can see this character Madda on Alif. So it's missing when we copied the text. So what you have to do, you have to select. So let's fix this one. Select this Alif and go to select your language. So if you are using Windows, so you need to turn on this specific option. So you need to go to settings languages and you have to add languages. So I have added a number of Arabic languages. So let's choose Arabic and let's open the keyboard viewer. So if you're using Windows, you just need to search for on screen keyboard. So there you go. So there you can see if I press shift, here comes Alif and Mud. So after selecting this, let's replace it with this one. So yeah, there you go. This is how we can fix uh, the, these kind of characters because uh, by default, these are not copied uh, to the to the Adobe InDesign. So we need to add it manually. So, and you can uh, read and you can verify the rest of the text. But this is one of the things that I want to discuss that how we can fix this issue. You need to install Arabic language and just you have to select that specific character and hit uh, select from your keyboard. And if we go to Photoshop, let's try the same method in Photoshop as well. Okay, select all. Let's go to text. Select all and you have to go to windows paragraph okay so it's already uh, right aligned go to these menu option and there you have to select middle eastern features so if if you are using photoshop then you have to select this specific option inside paragraph select menu and go to middle eastern features okay now you have to go to character uh, you can find character here and we have to select the font. So let's go to Nurahira. Let's go back to English and Nurahira regular. Select all, copy the text, go back to Photoshop and select all paste yeah so this is how you can copy and paste quran text in photoshop as well so let's increase the size so a very similar issue alif and that specific character mud so let's bring it back go back to arabic go open the keyboard viewer and you have to select this alif and let's press shift and press this button yeah so we have fixed the issue so you can still read and you can verify the rest of the text so it's very easy and these are the very simple steps for copying and pasting the quran text let's go back to adobe indesign and let me guide you that how you can copy and paste the translations. So, so let's remove 
these lines let's create a rectangular frame click here and go back to uh, this website quranclipphelper.com and we need to copy the translation in urdu so hit press copy go back to indesign and paste so for this specific uh, let's change the text let's go with adobe okay so don't forget to change your language adobe uh okay let's choose some other urdu fonts i have installed some urdu fonts okay let's choose uh myriad arabic and let's check the the properties let's go to paragraph hit this option and yeah we have not selected this adobe world ready single line composer and so this is how we can fix the translation we just copied so let's get back to paragraph and start from the right side so inhe iske bare mein kuch bhi ilm nahi aur na hi unke abawazdad ko so yeah it's uh, it's perfect let's copy the english tra english translation i'm just copied that specific uh, rectangular frame get back to this specific website and you just have to hit english so yeah english translation has been copied go back select all paste go to paragraph and set the properties that start from the left side and yeah so they have no knowledge of this nor did their forefathers so yeah this is how you can copy the quran text and the translation from quranclipphelper.com and you just have to copy and paste inside your tool so quran text is working perfectly almost very close to perfection in adobe indesign and adobe photoshop but not in illustrator yeah the text is good but here you can see that on this lam if you uh, focus on these uh, special characters so this zabar should be above the shad uh, if you are copying if you want the text exactly the same that you have copied from this website but this is not the case in it's not the same in adobe illustrator but it's working good in adobe indesign there you can see and adobe photoshop uh there you can see so uh, the one more benefit for copying the text instead of using the images is that you can select any of the words and you can change the colors uh you can you can resize the words windows go to character and you can resize the size of the words or the size of the characters so this is the benefit for copying the text instead of using the images you can change the colors and you can resize the the size of the text and you can adjust so for example you want it to be presented in this specific manner and you want to place an image on the left side of the of of your a banner you want you are going to design or the thumbnail you are going to design so th these are the benefits for copying the images and this is one of my favorite website that i found uh, uh which is working perfectly almost close to perfection when i copy quran text from this website so he's the person muaz uh who has been 
uh, working on this website and you just have to if you if you want to uh, appreciate the efforts he put then you just have to go to his instagram and send him a message that we love the website and we love the effort you put so thank you so much jazakala so this is how you can copy the text and uh, you can uh, write in photoshop and in design so let me know that how do you find this method so if you ask from me then i loved it see you in the next video thank you so much